your boy a shaggy being well if you're in this channel guys i would like you to kill murder and smash that little subscribe button okay so without any further ado in this tutorial i'm gonna teach you how you're gonna flash um stock chinese rom okay stock chinese rom into your phone all right so i'm i'm gonna show you uh my phone is currently a global phone all right it was uh I bought it on AliExpress. Okay. Um yeah, so uh, basically I'm gonna show you how you're gonna flash a stock CN Rome. CN that means Chinese. Okay, so you need all these files. Okay, so don't worry, I'm gonna leave all the things in the video description. Okay, alright, so basically, this is the latest um, Chinese, I was gonna say secure version, ZUI 11. Okay, so this is the latest ZUI. Okay, and it's 3GB. So, what you wanna do, you wanna create a folder, like all it, whatever you'd, you'd like. Just drag this and put it into there. And right there, just uh, win all and extract here. Okay, and don't forget to remove this zip file back. Okay, all right. So basically, this is a Lenovo USB driver. So what you want to do is we're gonna run this. Okay, run X next and install I hit finish wait wait for it yeah so you're gonna close this and then you're gonna you're gonna install this Qualcomm as well okay so as you can see I already installed it another version of this product is already installed okay then you wanna install this one. Alright, and you you wanna proceed with the installation. Okay. I accept install. Alright, so once you've installed all of this and you've done that thing, what you wanna do, you wanna go ahead and restart your PC. Okay, restart. Alright. Alright guys, so after you've restarted your PC, okay, so the last step what you wanna do, you wanna drag this. Uh you may wanna call it like firmware. Okay, drag this firmware folder onto your desktop. Alright? Okay, here it is. You fill. Okay, uh, make sure I run this as admin. Alright. And then right here you're gonna select flat build. You're gonna click on configuration, file host configuration, and make sure that the download protocol is set to uh, Sahara. And this one device type E double M C and reset after download. Okay, this one. Yeah, this one. So all you have to do is to click configuration and check for three things. Okay, it's a download protocol. You want to set it to Sahara device type EMMC and then reset after download. Make sure it is checked. Click OK. Now what you want to do is you want to click this and select desktop. You know, locate the firmware folder, which is right here, and we're gonna load the DDR elf. Okay, this one, not the light, but this one. And when I hit open, okay. So next, you know, I click load XML. When I uh, load this one, the raw program zero and the patch. Okay, patch uh, zero. All right, it open, 
And now, now you have to do this trick on your phone. All right, I'm gonna show you. So basically you'll have to press both the volume up and down while you input the charging cable. Oh yeah, so first of all, what you need to do is you wanna, you wanna go to settings. Okay. You wanna open settings. And then you wanna go to about phone. Okay, and where you see the Lenovo version, you wanna tap on that. Okay, and you wanna enter your fingerprint or passcode or whatever. So once you've done that, you wanna back out. Okay, you wanna click back and then you wanna go to advanced settings. Here you're gonna see developer option. So you wanna turn this on, okay? Make sure developer is on and you wanna make sure this one OEM unlocking is on and USB debugging. This okay there you go okay so once you've done that just close this and simply power off the device just yeah, shut it down now make sure that you plug in the like whatever it can be at the back or it can be at the front okay so if it's not detecting at the front so if it's not detecting at the front then you want to connect it at the back okay at the back i mean right there okay at the back of your motherboard all right so basically right here guys so this is a volume down up so you have to press both simul simultaneously like this and this and keep pressing on both while you enter the cable okay usb-c cable okay i'm still holding so now you, you can release it all right so once you release you're gonna see right here it's going to say qualcomm this all right so now i'm gonna record on pc okay guys so as you can see it got detected right here it's uh qualcomm hs usb q loader okay com4 okay com4 and now all you have to is click the download button so once you hit the download button it will take about five to ten minutes and you you gotta make sure that your usb does not get disconnected and you don't disconnect your phone whatever you do don't disconnect your phone until it gets restarted by itself so here we go all right so as you can see right here we are currently flashing and i keep i i, I can see like success but right here you see this little thing you'll have to wait until it uh it goes right here okay and yeah if you did have something on your phone like backup or whatever uh you might want to back up your phone because uh doing this thing guys you're flashing your device from global room to stock chinese okay english version of chinese room and this will erase everything on your phone okay it will erase everything so say if you have like apps uh google apps authenticator whatever make sure that you have already back up that to maybe an account to your account or to um another mo uh, mobile device okay all right so there's no percentage or whatever so maybe I would say like it's like 75 or yeah now it's like 90 percent okay so it's done as you can see finish download download succeeded we got waiting for reset done download succeeded and then finish download and now you uh, you probably hear that you gotta wait for it to as you can see the 
they know who. Fine. Huh? So what they screen on your PC, you are done right here. So <clears throat> you may want to minimize that. Just don't close it yet. Just minimize it. Okay. And it's going to be on the boot, uh, on the boot screen right here on the main logo will appear so it's going to be like that for about five minutes five to ten minutes all right and it's going to be okay so don't worry all right all right just wait for it to so this process right here as you can see now it's under the UI okay Boom. it got restarted by itself okay and now as you can see the language it's freaking Chinese okay so as you can see I'm currently uh, setting my fingerprint all right my fingerprint and even though it the language is Chinese I'm trying I'm fi I'm figuring it out myself. Okay. All right. So what are those? QQ. All right. So it comes the the stock room. It comes with some. Uh, how do I call this? This uh, preloader apps say if you don't want them like i don't want this i don't want that that dolphin browser say i don't want it maybe i'm just gonna select only this one and there's a skip button right here as well you can skip uh holy shit what is this so, yeah. Alright guys, so basically, yeah, now I gotta go to settings, um, what the hell is language, so this is, oh my god, <laughs> yeah, I do have another phone, another Lenovo phone, so I'm gonna, like, bring that one and then I'm gonna do it, okay, so, yeah. Hold on a second. So let's see if my fingerprint will work. Yeah, fingerprint works. Okay, so let's go to this one settings okay now i'm gonna open settings right here as well so home so scroll completely down to maybe advanced settings yeah yeah okay so the advanced settings is one two three four five Okay, so basically, I'm gonna have to like the icon. Okay, so you can see the advanced settings, uh, the gear. So I'm gonna find it right here. Okay, and I'm gonna click this once again so the language and input is at the first one 
language input at the first one. Okay, let's click that. And the first one, okay, English United States. You can see, bam. All right, now back out and voila, guys. Okay. Okay, so you can see now, uh, now the phone will get full OTA update. Alright, so you can see it got ZUI Lab. So if I check in the system update, agree and continue. Okay, ZUI version 11. So there's a lot of both um, pre-apps installed like Baidu, whatever, Chinese, Dian Ping. So I'm going to have to like one by one, one by one uninstall. Uh, Baidu map, I'm going to leave that. May Tuan, whatever this is, uninstall. Okay, so yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope this was helpful. Yeah, uh, luckily I had <laughs> a phone, so I could relate uh, both phone, uh, basically the same model. So yeah, uh, thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope this was helpful.